Boys and girls, welcome back to a brand new video. And in today's video, we're going to be playing the Observatory from Super Mario Galaxy or Galaxy 2. I really want to say this is Super Mario Galaxy 2, but I don't actually know. And like I say in the beginning of all of my videos, thank you so much for the support recently. It's been absolutely mad. We're on the road to 1,000 subscribers. So if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe and turn post notifications on. I upload at 6pm GMT every Monday and Thursday. I think I need to get out of this little spot. I'm a little bit um, trapped, to say the least. Yeah, I'm a little trapped here. This is not good. And we're free, boys. We're free. Let's go. I have watched a few gameplays on this map before, and I don't think there's a viable ending, but there's a pack-a-punch. And you can feed dragon heads from the Eisendrak, which I think is pretty cool. That's how you unlock the pack-a-punch. I was so close to getting that then. Oh, my God. Hello, my little friend. When you go into those there, you end up in one of these. And I think there's a fifth one. Some it's right there. I was going to say it's somewhere, but it's right there. Hang on a minute. Is there zero gravity in this, like in Moon? I think there is. Boing. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, then. That's one way to start a video off. Insta-kill, let's go. You're all going down, I promise. And now I can finally afford the Kudo. Did I actually remember that name? Yes, I did. Let's go. Where's the power? I can't actually remember where it is. I do remember where Quick Revive is, though, because I need it right now. I got myself into a bit of a sticky one again. Oh, man, this is not good. Excuse me. Thank you. Just, yeah, get out the way, please. No way. No, 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 no. Yes. So this is the first of three dragon heads. It takes a while for them to spawn in usually, but I got lucky this time and they spawned in straight away. On my first playthrough, they literally took a whole two minutes to spawn in. Why am I playing like a bot right now? I'm stuck. I'm stuck again. I'm stuck. Oh my God. Oh, you know what's mad? You know when I'm playing and I'm not recording because I play this all the time anyway. I play really well, but then as soon as I feel like somebody's watching me, I play like an absolute noob. I've got to wait for these guys to get in kissing distance of me and then shoot them. Otherwise, it doesn't register with this guy. Are you still hungry after all that? Oh my gosh. I'm guessing you're the last one. Dragon head number one completed. Let's get out of here before I die. And we have power, my friends. Let's get it. And there's nothing here other than Widow's Wine. I'm going to get you later, though, because you're quite expensive. What is happening? Why are they floating? I'm getting a little bit sick of this gun, so I'm going to hit the box. I don't know how to get there, though. I'm going to guess that you just jump all the way up here and you eventually get to the box apparently so i just go along there i literally got this on my first playthrough the first time i hit the box as well wow i'm guessing this guy that made the map doesn't like me today the zombies have glitched they're stuck right there where's the other one? Oh, he's there hello so i'm gonna guess and say you have to feed all three dragons i think one's in there and the other one is in that one there and then you can go up to feed another dragon or something and then that's the pack a punch is that a double point yeah and you're gonna make me sit up here no nah, i'm going to get it bro i know one of the mini observatories has a juggernaut in i just can't remember which one it is but i have a feeling it's that one this looks like a difficult one i can't lie got the table in the middle which i'm gonna clip on i just know it yeah this isn't gonna be fun you know what i should probably get a juggernaut first hello my friend it's been a while. Dude really just gave me the Barrett. I didn't want to go up. Oh, man. I didn't want to go up here. Let's see if I can time it right and slide straight back down. Yeah, let's go. I'm just going to have to do what everybody does on Modern Warfare 2 and spray and pray. Also, if you've seen my most recent video at the time of posting this, and I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to see more of that or custom maps in general, then let me know in the comments down below. This is madness. Yo, why is my boy so goddamn hungry all the time? There's three of you as well. I like how you give me an insta-kill when there's three zombies left. That's ridiculous, my friend. That is absolutely ridiculous. And he's done. Let's get it. So that has Widow's Wine. That one has Juggernaut. That one has a dragon. And that one has a dragon. So that means that there must be one up there because I'm pretty sure there's three. The only reason that I just took PHG is if I fall off of there without it, I'm dead. And now I'm a man and a Barrett, which isn't a good combination, especially in zombies. I need to quickly round up some points so I can... That was a great no-scope, so I can get the box one more time. I can't survive just with the Barrett. That is insane. In my Teletubbies video, I said the Wazoo is awful, and I still hold that claim. Please, yes, yeah, Steph Machine. Please don't give me another sniper. I'm not having the best of luck with a box right now. I don't even know if there's any wonder weapons in it, to be completely honest. Before we go all the way up there, I want to get some more perks, and I want to have an extra thousand at least so i can buy the observatory door and just do it straight away so then we've done it all and opened the pack a punch i really love how accurate this map is though to be honest you've got the sun moving there which to be fair they could have just put a static image and it would have been fine it's just the fact that they went the extra mile and even put the moon gravity in it even though the moon gravity does make sense it's just a nice little touch do you know what i mean it's just those little things that they didn't have to put in it still would have made it a cool map without it but they did put it in and i think that's really cool have the zombie spawns glitched where are the rest of them 
Can I buy this door? Apparently not. I mean, to be fair, it is a cloth. I should just be able to walk through it and not give some random thing a thousand just to walk through there. Sliding with the moon gravity, so I nearly fell off. I'm not even going to lie right now, I just got myself in such a pickle. I always wondered where this perk was when I was playing this yesterday. Now, the real question is, where's Mule Kick? Because I made a deal with a guy in my comment section that I would use it. What are you doing, mate? Because, listen, I slate Mule Kick off all the time and say that I don't use it. I think it's the worst perk ever made. Blah, 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 blah. Which I still think it is, but I'm going to give it a chance just for this subscriber because he's been going on and on to me about it for a long time in my comment section. I have a whole one bullet. What am I going to do with this? Oh my god, triple collette! Collateral! Single, that was a collateral as well. Nice. And we're going to go for the triple. Ooh. Really? Again? It's literally giving me the same weapons. Help you buy out, please. There we go, the MP40. Wait, is this an MP40? It's like a futuristic version. What game is this from? To be honest, I just want the ray gun because I just feel like it's really fitting considering we're in the middle of a galaxy, apparently. Please give me one more good gun. I can't be dealing with the Barrett right now. And you've gave me the China Lake. Okay. I bet the drop rates for the wonder weapons are ridiculously low in this. I'll take this. It's better than nothing. See, this is where I'd need a deadshot daiquiri on PC because it lowers the hip fire and I'm using a shotgun. I mean, who plays zombies like this with a shotgun? Do you know what I mean? This is the final dragon, boys and girls, and then we can hit the pack-a-punch when I've finally got enough points. How did I just survive that? Insta-kill. And double points. Let's go. Come over here, zombies. And a max ammo. Okay, this game's treating me all right right now. This is the difference Deadshot makes to the hip fire. And the dragon is done. The pack punch is finally open. So now I'm going to sweat it out and get as much points as I possibly can. This is the scariest jump I've ever made in my life. I'm so glad that I've got PhD right now. And I'm stuck on a zombie. Wait, I'm going further up. Okay then, hello. Good morning. How are you guys doing? And we have the pack a punch. I hope the camo is really good because for some weird reason I like to heavily judge maps based on how cool the pack a punch camo is. I don't know if anybody else is the same like that as well. If there's any pet peeves you have in zombies, feel free to let me know in the comment section down below. I'm curious to know. Oh no, I'm stuck. No, I'm not. Cool. This camo's nice. I can't remember what game it's from though. I feel like I've seen it before. Is it Dark Matter? So where is Mule Kick? Is it in this map? This might help us out, actually. So we have Elemental Pop, and Widow's Wine is in there, and Double Tap is there. The only time I get double points is the only time there's no zombies spawning. I hate this. It's not in here at all. I can't see it anywhere. Can you imagine if it's in there secretly or something? That would be mad. Dude really gave me the sawn off shotgun when I've got a shotgun in my hands. Like, what is your problem? I'm going to take it, though. I wonder if I can land up there. I've got to be able to land up there, otherwise it wouldn't be there. You know what? I don't actually think I can get there, even if I'm on top of there. Mule Kick isn't in here either. It's just Deadshot Dakara. Yeah, Mule Kick isn't anywhere. It's not even near the Packer Punch. Okay, I'm gonna get it just so I don't die while waiting for that. And we have got the Jewel Worlds. This looks sick. Okay, I'm gonna try and make the leap. Really doubt I'm gonna do it, but let's try it anyway. Yeah, I'm not even close. The only perk I'm missing now is Elemental Pop, but I don't really want it, to be honest. I really want a Mule Kick, as contradictive as that sounds, considering everything else I've said. And I can't even get it, which is really annoying. Why does it keep giving me this? This is actually insane. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I'm still alive. I think we've done everything that we need to do, and I'm just actually really disappointed that I can't find Mule Kick. So what I'm going to do is, is I'm going to let these guys down me, and I think I'm going to call it a day. I'm going to have to let you down me, my friend. Hang on a minute. Let me just get rid of this. If we're going down, we're going down in style, so I have an idea. Hello, darkness, my old friend. So I've heard from a little trusty source. I'm stuck on there. So I've heard from a little trusty source there's a death barrier, like, right over here. We're going to give it a leap of faith. But not before I try and trick shot a zombie with it. Let's put my sensitivity up a little bit. Here we go. That's really quick. Oh my god, that's insane. Let's try it. I missed. And I'm dead. See, I told you there was a death barrier. 